Hi guys! After dealing with both statements and questions in the previous videos, did you really think we were done with reported speech? I'm afraid we aren't. <laughs> it's now time for comments, requests and suggestions. In this video, we'll learn how to change commands, requests, and suggestions into reported speech. But before we start off, let me ask you a question. Do you think you can tell a command from a request? Take a quick look at these two. One's a command and the other one's a request, but which is which? Yay! You're right on spot. The first one's a request. I was being nice, you know, minding my P's and Q's, and that was only five minutes before I lost it. And said the second one, which is a command, an order. When we report commands, the most commonly used verb is tell, but we can also use others such as um, order, command, warn, especially for the negative. Now take a look at the way we usually report commands. Okay, so now that you've already got familiar with the structure, let's put it into practice. Now that meeting face-to-face -face is not advisable anymore, I'm getting used to video calling my friends. Last week, I had a really nice chat with my friend Simon. He's a British gentleman. Oh, his accent. But he can also be a little bit bossy at times. Listen to what he told me and to the way I changed it into reported speech. Anna, be punctual. I'll pick you up at eight tomorrow. Simon told me to be punctual because he would pick me up at eight the following day. Anya, Alan. Don't be so noisy. Simon ordered Annie and Alan not to be so noisy. Don't try to tease me. He warned me not to try to tease him. Notice there is no backshifting verb tenses anymore, but we still change words like determiners, pronouns, or time and place expressions. Well, I'm sure this was a no-brainer for you, so let's move on to requests. Now, would you be so kind to give the next chart the once over so that you can get familiar with the structure of reported requests? We usually report requests using the verb ask. However, and depending on the nuance, uh, you can also use other verbs like beg. My friend Simon is not always so assertive and the other day he also made some requests. We miss you. Could you please come back to the team? Simon asked me to go back to the team. Anna, please don't leave me with this woman again. Simon asked me not to leave him alone with that woman. Please, please let me know if Linda's coming this afternoon. He begged me to let him know if Linda was coming that afternoon. Within this structure, bear in mind that when somebody makes a request asking for something like an object, we report it slightly different. Can I have another pint? He asked for another pint. All right, so we're devoting the last section of this video to suggestions. One of the most important things about suggestions is for you to learn how to spot them, because not all of them look alike. They can take many different forms, and there are also different ways of introducing them. But today, we'll learn how to report them using the verb suggest. There are other reporting verbs that might be of help when reporting suggestions, but we'll deal with them in the next and last video about reported speech. Again, take a quick look at the following chart, which will show you some examples of suggestions.
let's go for a drink together when things get better. Simon suggested that we should go for a drink together when things got better. Why don't you do a video on British culture? He suggested that I do a video on British culture. How about making another video call next week? Simon suggested making another video call the following week. So far, so good. Are you now ready to show me how much you've learned today? You already know how this works. You've got 10 seconds to change the original sentences into reported speech. I can't wait to see how erudite you are. Let's get started. Hey, you little monkey, don't touch my unicorn. Good job! Anya warned Ellen not to touch her unicorns. Now let's go to Cambridge when the corona is gone. Yay! Alan suggested that we should go to Cambridge when the corona is gone. Well, 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 shall we call it a day? The teacher suggested that we should call it a day. Okay. <laughs> or the teacher suggested calling it a day. Well, guys, I hope you found this video helpful and not too heavy. Remember to keep working hard. As I always tell you, practice makes perfect. It was so nice to see you again. I'll see you guys soon to take a look together at other reporting verbs.